April was the month of the military child. To celebrate, let's take a look at some of Lake Braddock's own military-affiliated students. I like moving when I get to like, it gives you a chance to see new people when like, live in a lot of different areas, but it's also nice to stay in one place. It's just like, it sucks. It's pretty undescribable. It just sucks. Like, cause there's nothing you can do about it. So it's just like, it sucks. I moved, yeah, we moved a lot before fourth grade for me, but then it kind of like settled down a bit more. And since then, there's only been, I think, three moves. Uh, the toughest thing is moving. <laughs> I think that it puts a lot of strain on you and your family, and it really sucks because you just keep going to different places, and I don't like it at all. I think it's made me a lot more, like, outgoing because I do have to go and, like, meet a lot more, more people in different places. It also helps with, like, my dad always taught me, like, how to talk to adults and stuff, because he would, when I did meet his coworkers, you have to be a bit more, like, serious if you're at, like, his workplace, so. It's also nice seeing them after they've been deployed. <laughs> As a military kid growing up, I had the opportunity to move overseas a lot, and while being overseas, I got to have all these different experiences that not many people my age got to have. And by doing this, I became a pretty resilient kid. Uh, being in different cultures really helped me appreciate uh, other parts of the world. And I think being thrown into all these different countries so fast really allowed me to make friends. <laughs> it's nice to have a pet that, like a dog or a cat, because every single time you move, they move with you, you know? So it's nice. This is Lilia, Grace, Hannah, and McKenna signing off on The Morning Brew.